lofty expectations for this matchup as round one gets underway. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but on the other, truly a fighter who can do it. And that guy will usually have the advantage on paper. When you're a striker at this guy's level, that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has. Well, perhaps a side of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length, of course. It's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Over and over, he lands these big body kicks. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Lands flush with the left hand. Big kick lands. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he's landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. And they are exchanging leather early. Oh, what a kick. Oh, straight right. Nice body kick right under the elbow. Just a slip there. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, locking his head, and making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. And he landed the right hand there. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Let's get going now. Just over three minutes to go round one. Can't take many of those, you better check. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Great connection. He's in a great flow right now. Doubled up on the jab there. Nicely done by Lee. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. Oh, nice. Well, he felt like he had to kick effectively to win this fight, and he is certainly doing that right now. Nice combination of kicks. His kickboxing coach is feeling ecstatic right now, watching the guy employ his kick-heavy strategy. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Nice leg kick. Pretty good kick there by Lee. Oh, left hook to the head, it's blocked. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee to the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. Oh, and he lands another leg kick there. I have a novel idea. Maybe the opponent should try to check one of these. He's got to try to check him, but he can't, John, because there's no wind-up. Yeah. There's no tell. And when he feels his opponent is getting a beat on his leg kicks, he'll just pop a jab on Get the hands up to block the face, blast the leg kick on the bottom. It's unbelievable to watch a guy that is so diverse yeah. and has such a great understanding of landing these leg kicks. Ooh, what a punch. And both guys really throwing with authority. Bone on bone as the head kick lands flush. He better get those hands up or he's going to put him to sleep. Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Big head kick lands. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Straight punch land. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Seconds to go. Able to land there with the straight left. Kick to the body by Lee. Ooh, what a punch. 
Horns out for the end of round one. A lot of high-level highlights from that last round. DC, take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are gonna really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole <laughs> platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh, man. That's jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did, because I have times where I've been kicked like that. And I'm gonna tell you one thing, it does not feel good. Oh, big left hand there. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice leg kick lands. Lands flush with that right hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Real nice body kick lands. Just misses with the straight right. His hands are down. Let's set up that high kick. Now. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. Watch the ability to land from anywhere. The kickboxing chops on full display with that offering nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. We march on three minutes to go. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, big head kick. Able to land with that punch. Powerful leg kick lands. He blocks the punch. That was a nice strike. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. And they separate. Right hand on point. Oh, nice right hand. Big right hand. He went high on that one. Drive for that takedown. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach and certainly is making it count in this one. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Good punch lands. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. What a tricky head kick. How about the volume of kicks out of this fighter tonight? And it really speaks to just how much a fighter can develop in three to five months away from the octagon. Yeah, he's doing a fantastic job of showing the evolution of his game in this kick-heavy approach. Big right hook coming in front. Good punch. Finish. Man, looks 
looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Oh, huge right hand. Big knee to the body. She just misses there with the left. Beautiful strike. Nice head kick. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not going to check, if he's going to stand there, and he's not on his toes, and he's stationary, you keep driving those kicks into his thighs, into his body, until he makes some sort of adjustment. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step to getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Oh, good job defensively to block the strike there by Lee. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Lee's got a bruise starting to appear on that right side of his body now. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and largely has gotten it done with his striking tonight. He got it done with his strike. He fought well behind the jab, but it was significant strikes that really did make an impact on the judges' mind. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. A good right hand right there. Misses again with a right punch. Watch the shot. Nice way to over the top. This fight's going to be over. This what a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, but he's going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, that right hand is on point. Gonna miss with that straight left hand. Right hook to the head blocked. Three minutes to go in round three. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. All right, so a seminal blow earlier in the round. It wasn't a knockdown, but it was certainly a stunner that caught his attention. Oh, I mean, he got hurt bad. To see him still standing, that just goes to the toughness that he has to be still standing after taking such a damaging shot. Nice connection with the punch there. It's hard to recall time in the past that his boxing looks this sharp. He's never looked this good. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Look at him working and trying to shut the liver down. Just out of range with that left hook. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Nice sneaky head kick. Oh, 
blocks the strike. So once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Oh, and he continues to pour it off. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. As he gets close, he's out of the kicking range. He'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. Lee's head kick is blocked. No damage there. Got clip with the right hand. Oh, he's feeling it now. Nice combination there by Lee. Ooh, looking to go to the leg kick here. Just out of range. Nice punch lands over the top. Back and forth we go here. Some nice power there with the left hook upstairs. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. That horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they barely broke in a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10 plus minutes of fight. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Great punch landed with so much power. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. He talked a lot to us about his length and his size advantage. Doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it certainly did. Oh, lands another punch there. Not a mean guy. He's just doing a smart thing. Oh, he has to be attacking that cut, John. I mean, if he's not, then he's doing his opponent a favor. Attack that cut. Make him pay for it. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Switching stances here. What a punch. Big leg kick land. Just missed with the elbow there. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now, as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are gonna count. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shit guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. How good is that right hand? Beautiful body kick. You're in a clinch, you can pull down on the head and land these beautiful punches to the head. Nice defense there, huge block. Big punch land. Ooh. Oh, that's a good right hand. Lands the right hand. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Right punches there. Street car jab. That's not a fuel jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Effective strike there by Lou. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh. <laughs> Big 
leg kick lands. Throws the right hand there. Nice kick. Well, he keeps going. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick he did not recognize it. It's high. And now he's got a rip bad. Ooh. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Oh, big left hook there. Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counters as we go forward. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, spinning back fist out of nowhere. Punch coming, it's blocked. Beautiful body kick. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Ooh, what a head kick. Trying the flying knee there. for the end of round four. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. there by Lee. Big kick. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Lunges forward with a left air. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Right under the elbow, the body kick lane. Good kicks there by Lee. And just misses with that big right hand. Another shot lands upstairs. Another one, yep. Oh, and the left hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, big punch land. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offer in there. That was a thudding leg kick. Oh, nice straight punch there by Lee. Glanza, glancing right hand upstairs. Back and forth we go! Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Nice punch there. He's trying to double up on that jab. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence. And when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. Nice. 
Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Damaging punch there. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Well, missed on that one. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Nicely done there to keep his hands up and block that strike. He's gotta protect that cut if he wants to keep the doctor out. He's gotta protect the cut, John, but he's also... Whoa! Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, blocks the shot. Gets hit by that leg kick. He loaded up that right hand too. Just missed with the left there. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding the target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to... Oh, what a head kick there as he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very fast with his head kick. Now we have to find one more strike to end the night. Just misses with that one. 15 seconds. It's such a fast leg kick. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. What a fight! All right, let's look back at some of the action, DC. They go the distance tonight, but you gotta think he won over the judges with his striking acumen. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision. Decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest, 50-45. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee!